How's it going, Zero Wars? Welcome back to another video of Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. Continuing, as you all can see, we're continuing. Nice now, let's just scan this. But what are we scanning? Vault stuff, I guess. Um, we're going into this vault, I guess. Like, I don't know how that is. It doesn't even, like, is this a door or something? Or what? what is it? Okay, we'll just put our hand on this and see what goes on. Okay, he's touching it nice and sexually, y'all. Does it make him horny? Or I'm joking, but... Oh, wait! It was the door here! He just touched it, the crack, and it opened, y'all. Holy crap! See, he just had to make it, like, sweet love. Touch it nice and lovely. You know, making it won't hurt it, so it will open. <laughs> All right, in we go. Thank you, door, for opening. I don't know where you're leading us to in this crack. Uh, Amazing. Oh, this place is nice. This is a good hiding spot. We should set up camp here. This is where a camp should be. Is right here. What is that, BD1? Scan it, please. Thank you. You all right, BD? Is it okay? Well done. Who's this well, putt? I don't know who you, you are. The test I left behind. Are you Obi Wan Kenobi's and father? To the vault and this recording, <laughs> one looks like him. Would look like him, man. In the I am Master Eno Kodoa. Oh, you're Eno I may Godo. I know your name, but I know your purpose. I Eno Godo. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. I'll be quiet and cussing. This place, this vault, is a sacred temple. Built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the Force. A vision of doom. I well, have I placed think I'm inside good. this vault a Jedi holocron. Containing a list of the names and locations of young Force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Like that Seek robot? Out the hidden tombs of the three sages. And right? learn to you must know that robot because it's coming from you. As the Zephyr once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zephyr homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the Force be with you. Thank you, Seggy Balls Man Jedi. And may the Force be with you. you. He's probably dead. Meet. Why are you sitting in the water? Now your pants are wet. I guess you know, didn't I've care. been alone for a while now. But you're not now, no, are you? Purpose, just hiding. No, you had that your friend until he died. It's no way to live. No, it isn't. Not for a Jedi. No, not for a Jedi. Or a droid. Or, yeah, I agree, not for a droid either. Maybe Seer was right. That droid needs a friend. Maybe we're done hiding. Yep. Hey. You want to meet some, uh, friends of mine? Sounds excited. I don't speak robot, but that sounds like excitement to me. A long time ago. Hey, the tro trophy I got, y'all. Discover, unlock, whatever that says. So this is the vault. Can we unlock it? Like, well, there's, there's nothing in this vault. So that, that robot, that, that robot, except, uh, that robot showing a hologram. I guess we had to go to this vault to make him do the hologram. He doesn't want anyone else to see it, I guess. Just in case someone's spying on us. Who knows? There could be creeps out they there. Found what you wanted me to see. Whoa, 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 like whoa. whoa. I need to heal. We'll be waiting. Okay, just one second. Um, rest, please. Yeah, there we go. We all healed up, y'all. We all healed up. Slided. Woo! Surfing in the mud we go on this planet called Bingo. What's his name? I'll be... I'm joking. That's not what the planet's called. 
The planet is called... Um, I don't know what the planet's called. I can't remember. Bongo- Oh, hey, hey! Yo, what up? What up? Hey, you're not eating me! I know you were trying to eat me before. No, ow! You chomping on me! That's not cool, bro! I mean, this is what you- Ow, 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 ow. I'm just defending myself, okay? This is self-defense. Okay. Okay, I'm sick and tired of you chomping on me. No. 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 You need to stop it. No, 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 no. You put that tongue away. No, no, I don't want to be licked by you. You disgusting thing. And then you try to eat me. Like, you try to lick me, try to do something, and I need to heal. I need to heal. Heal. Hurry. Help! Hey, hurry! God, B BD1, hurry the frick up! You're gonna get me killed. Okay, okay. Uh, I'm trying to back away. I should have jumped. Okay, you want some of this, Biatch? Let's go. Okay, we couldn't block that. Okay, R.I.P. Me. Uh, the, the worst Jedi here. Um, no Jedi Master. Why did I pick that difficulty? All right, Z, where's that? Was just a warm up. You hear me when I get back to that thing. Alright, but back to that thing. That, this time, there's no losing. I can't promise anything, though. Oh, 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 you, oh! I'm a Jedi! Okay, I'm not a Jedi Master. I'm getting cocky. Ow, ow, ow! I'm getting chopped! Oh, you sick, you sick mother flower! Ah! Oof. Oof. I was trying to jump. I'm pushing the jump button. Why are you not jumping, Cal? I'm literally spamming the crap out of the X button. And Cal's like, no, just eat me. Eat me. Because this time, it's go time and we're not dying. Whoa. Okay, now it's time to roll and then attack and then roll. I'm, I'm trying to roll and make sure I don't die. That's my... Whole goal is not to die. You missed. Ah! I just got to stay close to you. What is this? Freaking. No! Oh. Die! Finally! This time I didn't die. I like when I don't die. Scan it, B BD1. My little robot buddy. My little robot buddy, buddy, buddy. He's my little robot buddy. He helps me out, y'all. He helps me out. Okay, where are we going from here? Um, I'm wondering how would I get that. Come here, BD1. I know there's a chest around here, but well, not around here, but somewhere. Okay, let's just run. Can we run on the wall? No, just jump down. All right, that works too. Um, is there anything in here? No, it doesn't look like it. But we do have to run on this wall, though. Is there anything down there, though? I don't see anything. Oh? It's a... It's scanning a wall. Mm -hmm. Is that wall special to you, BD1? Oh, My special friend, to the saggy balls, man. It okay. appears the Zepho had some interest in death of you. Strange for such a peaceful culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so dark. Doesn't look too dark to me, but I don't know what you mean by dark like a dark story, or because it's definitely you don't mean the planet's dark. <laughs> okay, can we open this? Open sesame, please. Open, thank you. Let's go, BD1. Took you a while, but thank Should you. Be a lot quicker than the way in. I want to go and check stuff out, y'all. Really do. Let's go over here. Let's see if there's anything over here. So you all hear me? I don't know if you all should come along or, or should we not or what? Because there's a wall over here that we had to run on, I think. Um. Not 100% sure. I feel like we can run on that wall, but I feel like we can't at the same time. 
How about this wall? Can we run on that wall? Can we make it? No, we probably die. Okay, never mind. Let's just continue on. Let's not waste our time. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That wall we can definitely run on. Whoa, this wall right here. Yes, that, that was a professional wall running right there, y'all. Not really, but anyways. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. How would we... Wait a minute. There's something over here, y'all. I need to stop that and that. All right. Hmm. The question is, how will this work? Oh, definitely that's not how it works. <laughs> how do you get that? I don't know, y'all. I really don't. I'll probably come back here at, off uh, recording and figure it out. Maybe. Because I don't want to waste our time. <laughs> okay, y'all hear me in a second. Alright, Zewards, it was a pointless run. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm glad I edited it. Okay, now what? Okay, now what? Now where do we go? Is it this way? I want to say it's this way. I think. Oh, this is the way. Wait. I'm confused. Okay, no, no, no. You bugger off, you little pricks. You, you bugger off. BD1, over here. I'm just trying to... Can we go up? Yes, we can. I know we have to get back. I'm just trying to remember... How? Can we even make it across? Well, maybe we can make it across here by jumping. I'm not too sure though, but we'll test it. <laughs> Damn it! No, we cannot. That's a negatory! But I think this is the right way anyways. Can we can we make this jump at least? Almost, but nope. <laughs> Let's try it again. Can we make it? <laughs> no! Dang it, that sucks. I was hoping that we could make that jump, but we can't. Oh well. Um, I wish I could get up there. There's probably a way, but you probably need something. I'm guessing it's to do with that, maybe, or maybe not. I don't know. Huh. I'll figure it out eventually. No, not right now, because I don't think we can. Wait, what, what? what's down here? I know I've been down here, but can we... Oh, wait, we don't have the force push. I think we need the force push to do something with it. Yeah. We, we can't even get on beyond there. So that's a pointless thing trying to do. But we do need a heal. That's for a fact, y'all. But it might heal us in the ship. I'm playing on Jedi Master on, difficulty, but I'm no Jedi Master. But it's not my first time playing this game. I have played this game on the Xbox One. So, yeah. Pass the test. So you knew about BD-1? Come on board. We'll talk inside. Okay. Oh, BD-1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? The oh, robot! Get, get, get off my sofa! Don't get out of there! Get out! Hey! God, be nice to him! Yo, Crank. Any idea how hard it is to get oil state out of Batoli Reed fabric? Not really. Oh. I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down. This droid will help he us. Did. He's my friend. Tell calm down, that. say you old the alien was balls built man. built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of force-sensitive children. 
The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. And that little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A hollow what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Do you now? Oh, that. Use the Force. Use the Force, young Padawan. <laughs> wow, that's this nice is map. Master Obi Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. Well, that sounds like that crappy list news. Of force sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. Okay, no problem. Let's get it. Well, except the Holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zeppo homeworld. All right, well, where are we going? I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. Look, that sounds like a good idea. Before we do anything, I need to know something. Okay, that, that's a good idea, How too. You're no longer a Jedi. Yeah. Why? Tell him. I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. Ah. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I don't disagree. I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. Exactly. Are you with us? We're in. I mean, if you feel like you don't have a choice, you have a choice. It's your choice. All right, cool. So where are we going to next, uh, say alien balls? When you want to go, let me know. I'll be right here. All right. Well, I'm going to go back here and check out some stuff, all right? Uh, I've seen some good stuff back here. Hey, there's a healing spot. And a skill area spot. Rest. And we have a new skill, y'all. What should we put it on? Should we put it on Super Saiyan? Or should we put it on meditating? <laughs> I'm joking. Uh, Cal's max life increase. Oh, yes. Yes, yes. We want his max life increase. Yes, please and thank you. Who? Yeah, these videos are probably going to be two on in the 25 minute area long, hopefully. Sometimes it might go over a little bit, just because of cutscenes, probably. Alright, that's a change the color. Okay, you have my favorite color, so blue. Um, what is this? Okay. Okay. Um. I, I, I don't know. I guess. This one doesn't look too bad. I mean, this lifesaver that we have, it looks pretty broken, to be honest. Like, look at the end of it. It's like a grip. I think that would be good. I like this. I like it. There we go. Blue with a different look. Hey, can we go down there? No. Damn it! I was hoping that we could go down there. That I could do a little bit of, you know, lonely stuff. If you know, don't know what I mean, then. Please, what's this? Good. Thing? What? You've never seen a terrarium before? Sure, but don't they usually have plants in them? Yanking on that chain. I'm a bit busy if you get that, you know what I mean. Around the galaxy, but you know, you could pay me back with some seeds. I thought you hated nature. When it's out there, you betcha. But when it's behind a comfortably thick wall of bar and glass. That's perfection. All right, I'll see if I can find it. How one. is that perfection? I don't understand that, but okay, whatever. For you it is. For me, I think being out there is more perfection than being behind a glass, but whatever. What do I know? I don't know nothing. 
Okay, we're going to them. I'm guessing this is where we have to go next to, right? Um. 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 I think it's this is where. Okay, wait, this is where we're going, or like. Oh yes, this is where we're going. I'm just pushing the wrong button. When this is all over, I think it'll be time to settle down. You know, fall in love, start a family. You do that, man. You do that. You? Yeah. You think a guy like me doesn't know love? I mean, I think. I bet you're gonna tell me. Let me tell you, it's the best, but a lot of work. It needs admiration, devotion, attraction, and respect. Please, that's actually very insightful. Yeah, well, it comes with experience. <laughs> Can't look this good and not steal a few hearts. <laughs> I mean, you look pretty... I don't know how aliens work, but I'm just saying, you look pretty old to have kids. But I don't know how old the, like, the generation for kids for aliens would be, so have kids, but... Anyways. Maybe it lasts forever. Who knows? Maybe kids, kids, kids that, no matter what this age, I don't know how old you live up to as an alien. Yeah, something strange. Those winds are interfering with our comms. Hey, Cordova mentioned something about peace in the eye of the storm. Well, I can just make out a settlement in the middle of it. Then we have to get there. Copy so go in that. the middle of the storm? Is that what we're doing? I mean, are you sure that's gonna work, Cal? Seems pretty windy. And cold. Oh, couple bumps ain't gonna kill you, kid. You <laughs> might, you never know, dude. Can you tell that bucket of balls to keep his opinion to himself? I'm sure everything's under control. What under do you control? have against that robot? Jeez. <laughs> I don't think that robot ever did anything to him. Hold on, hold on. He's just a cranky old man. Oh. Huh. Perfect landing. We made it to Planet Easy Blizzard. <laughs> but I'm still getting a lot of interference on the comms. It's gonna take me a minute to That's get That's not what it's called. Up. I'll search for signs of Cordova in the meantime. Good. I'll be in touch once I crack this. Okay, that means you're not gonna be in touch and you're never gonna help me. All right, Cal, thank you. Over here. Woman, I know what I, what? What do you want? Work on Pagano. The more information we gather on Cordova and the Zepho, Oh, it's not called the bingo? Oh. The Empire. I thought it was bingo. I'm <laughs> joking, about I them. didn't think that. I only knew that Cordova was, I was joking obsessed around when with I said Zepho, that. Believing their teachings to be important. I too was intrigued by the mysteries of our galaxy. You better get moving. There's a lot to learn. Well, the galaxy is a mystery, that's for sure. There's a lot of things out there that we don't know about. I find seats for Greece. You don't have to find seats for them, but we can. But, I mean, I wouldn't even know where to begin to look. Okay, I guess we're going on this planet. This freezing-ass planet. Or maybe it's not as cold as it, was, as it looked. Maybe a little nippy, but, you know, not too bad. Not too bad. It could be worse. No, it could be minus 500 to do minus 500. I mean, that you would be instantly work. dead. We did it. We did it. I hope you're not hurt. It's hurt. What do you it, look? It, it looks Who hurt. Who are you talking to? Uh, just my ship, the Manus. Good name, right? Intimidating. Oh, well, what do you know? You've probably never even flown a ship. Maybe I'll teach you one day when you're done with your Jedi stuff. I'll even give you a discount. With that attitude, I don't think I want to get taught by you. You don't deserve my money. But no, like, seriously, dude, you call me weird and you're talking to a ship. All right. I'm joking. You know, normal's overrated. You're fine. I'll just pay back. <laughs> okay, we're going to end this part here. So, yeah, like always, you words, I appreciate you all and stay awesome. Pop, pop, pop,